What's up guys, RJ LaPresti here with Cho's Hop Keto. I wanna make a video for you today about respect. So of course in martial arts, respect is something that's really big. Everywhere it says, your martial arts teaches respect. What does that mean? You know, does that mean that they just, we teach kids how to say yes sir and yes ma'am, but what does that really do? Why is that important and how does that help people in their everyday life? So yes, in martial arts we do teach our students to say yes sir and yes ma'am. And that is a, a form of showing respect. But what's more important is martial arts teaches the discipline and the extra step that people go through to make sure that they're paying extra attention to somebody who, who is in need of that respect. Whether it's a martial arts instructor or their parents, you know, the law enforcement officers or teachers at school, their elders. Martial arts teaches you to be mindful and to be aware of your situation right there at that moment so that you can appropriately react. It's gonna be different whether I'm hanging out with a peer, talking to a student, talking to a teacher, or, or someone who's my elder. It's gonna be different every time, but martial arts teaches you to be mindful and aware of the specific situation so you can pay it the proper amount of attention that is needed. So that's one of the things I love about martial arts is that yes, it teaches you to say yes sir and yes ma'am, and we bow, it shows respect, but it teaches you more importantly the the act of being mindful and being present focused so that way you can interact with people the way that you should be interacting with somebody based on how they are in relation to you. So martial arts teaches respect. It teaches you to say yes sir, we teach bowing and all these different etiquette things that, that ingrain respect into you. But more importantly, it teaches you to be focused in the present moment so that way you can give somebody the attention that they deserve. So have some good respect, everybody. Think of ways that you can improve your respect in your day-to-day -day life to yourself, to others, to objects, to everything. Live with passion, and I'll see you guys soon.